to Artie Tune, a podcast with artists created and produced by Detlef Schlick, a visual artist and ritual designer, living and loving in West Cork, and best known for his essay about the cause and effect of shamanism, art and digital culture. Working in the field of performance, photography, painting, sound, installations, and film he will dive and discover with us and a weekly creative guest into the unknown and exciting deep ocean of the creative mind. This is the Klepschlich, and today we dive into the deep and unknown exciting ocean of the creative mind with a reflection of two of my podcast um, conversations dark guests actually um it is paul Kopp and lou mcmahon i will come back to them later first of all i would actually reflect a little bit about um, the time between now and my last reflection which is already 12 episodes ago 12 episodes and four talk guests ago and um, in this time a lot happened i must say i mean especially the war in ukraine which really makes it sometimes for me difficult to to focus on on other things i mean i research a lot about that and i'm probably not the only one who is getting really concerned about these situations uh yeah it doesn't make me it, it's not easy for me to promote and my podcast you see i mean uh, it's, it's on, on one hand i know that that our life is continuing but on the other side uh, it is such a big impact for europe and as well for the whole world you know so so it's phew, scary especially actually yesterday was the day where I supposed to launch my 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 video editing um, from from a video by Schlag from no actually from 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 a song by Schlag called America is dying. Schlag is Schlag is um, Dirk Schlömer with his partner. I had Dirk already in my in my podcast. He, he used to be the guitarist of Tonsteine Scherben. And uh, he has a band project called Schlag. Um, and this song is inspired by an, an essay from Umar Hakwe, who is a, an, an economist, a critical an economist, and writes actually every day very uh, disastrous uh, um, dystopian essays. And this song is about America is dying. I mean, I mean, it is it is an, uh, it it is a metaphor for for the current situation. And I had as well to research then into that, which was for me as well very 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 disturbing somehow um, to create a video or was this subject, you know. However, that was yesterday supposed to be the launch, but Dirk is sick, so the launch is actually then next saturday at five o'clock and uh five o'clock irish time uh i think it's three o'clock it's five five we are five o'clock clock ahead from from california and uh and uh germany's one o'clock ahead from here and so on and so on i mean you're more than welcome to join us online because it's actually the first time when i when i'm gonna stream as well which is quite new for me as well so i have to look into the, into this technology and we will have as well an online chat where where we answer questions actually dirk and myself so i i have already a stream to to berlin via west cork berlin west cork so i hope everything will work well yeah so 
That is next next Saturday, and after that on 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 a Sunday, I, I will. You can listen it as well. Then 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 here Sunday morning at ten o'clock in my normal Altitude podcast. After that, I already have um, another guest. It is the Godfather uh, of punk, of Californian punk rock, Cliff Ronan. Cliff used to be as well a math and art teacher in the um, Oliver Wendell Holmes Humanities Magnet School and as well a member of uh, the weirdos in California punk rock band. So I'm really looking forward for that. This will be in two weeks already. So that's that's very quite exciting times somehow as well. I mean, I can't can't go back all the time into this horrible war. I just, I mean, maybe maybe a last word words to to this war in Ukrainian, dear people, dear listeners. I mean, don't take it on this way on board that you start to hate the Russians. I mean, I think it has nothing to do with the Russians in general. It is it is uh, it is more Putin. So please still be kind. Be kind to the Russians and uh, as well, I actually I, w- I was listening today to a little show called The Extraordinary Power of Kindness. So uh so just be a change maker and 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 try to be kind to each other so and don't start to hate russians okay that's on that notes my last sentence and um now i would like to continue with my um reflections actually uh about a friend of mine paul Cop the poet. I had him already in episode twenty point one, and if you're gonna go back, you uh, you might come as well to an interesting artist. So because uh, Paul is a poet who dedicated his his early life to traveling and discovering different cultures. So because of Paul's very close parental ties to Nigeria he developed a personal connection with that country so he so he became the the one who traveled to Egypt in his early 20s we're speaking about that as well as well um among other places only to find out that the people of Africa are not as wild as the prejudice of our western society preached you know so i mean he 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 had really, I mean, it's, it was very, 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 very interesting and exciting to speak with Paul about that. And um, I mean, now, now he's living here, here in Ireland, and uh, he is a seaweed activist and seaweed farmer here in Europe. So, because the, the Roaring Water Sea Vegetable Co-op was the first algae farm in Ireland. And actually, a, a pioneer in the field of algae farming, because uh, I mean, kelp farms also create an, an incredible habitat for smaller crustaceans and other creatures, other creatures that fish like to eat. So, this, this sea vegetable propagation techniques have evolved over the past fifteen years under the auspices of of Bart Yeskamara, the Irish. So Paul, Paul, Paul the poet is one of the visionaries who shows us new ways in which we can grow food and make a living that can both heal the planet and make life more satisfying. He's very much into that, and uh, he's getting better and better. And his his seaweed burgers they they taste very well. So. Um, but this is just just one part of him. He's he as well. He's running. He, he's running a, a coffee in in Bali the Hop, and uh, still still working on his, his his yard at the back of the coffee now to to create a, a huge cultural center here in West Cork in Bali the Hop, where bands can play outside. And and uh, there is already a puppet maker in it and. Uh, we used to run years before 
the Bali the Hub Social Club at this place. It was before Paul Paul bought this place. So uh, he still tries to to be a, a part of of West Cork's culture, with, which is quite interesting. And and he's he's so he's so disciplinized with it um, every day, and um, it's really it's somehow very exciting to see the way how he can how he continues with his work and and um, change change this place in something different. So it was yes it, it it was a great great talk with Park and I hope he can he can continue with that a long time I mean he's originally he came from England over with with his, with his fishing trailer and um he has sure he had to, as well a lot of different jobs like like a ferryman I think ferryman be, between here Bali the Hub and uh, close to Bali the Hub and was Cape Clear. So yeah, so 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 the ocean, the deep ocean of the creative mind is somehow his his habitat as well. Yes. So hi Paul, I hope you're well. And I had as well. I did one project with him called the Asylum Seekers, which I actually would like to to introduce now um it, it is uh, I, I made somehow an industrial uh, collage um from with him to get a performance uh with with his poem and uh yeah i might i might invite you now to listen to that you know so and and uh, yeah, don't hesitate to send me comments comments and uh Let's stay in discourse. So, Paul Cobb and that left wish um, the asylum seekers. Yes. In our time, there were no rules. We danced where angels fear to tread in the company of fools. We were dogs underneath the table of the gods. Fresh blood in the primeval mud. Players on the board after the flood, searching for the lost cord. We heard words unspoken, like quicksilver in stone water. Our minds blown wide open. And then the fallout began. began. Some, of some, sank. Sank. some of us sank. Some of us swam. Some of us swam. Love's flame flickered in the sexual ripoff. And mind games played in the masquerade. In the tangled forest of dreams, I'm a catalyst for this 21st century beach life so nondescript. My heart desire out of reach. Across the rainbow bridge in Valhalla, where my slain comrade feast. Hey, Mr. Lighthouse Keeper, I'm a Viking asylum seeker. Take me to your dream weaver. And let me get a toehold in this world Around which a serpent is curled Help me stay complimentous In a generation of misfits Hanging on by our fingertips Puppets in the hands of the spirits This slave don't suffer fools Got one foot in the grave It's a new set of rules Don't know how to behave Power is the motivation Money is the blood of the nation Adam and Eve were together before the fall. But if you live forever, you'd be sick of it all. Fat's cool like a deep freeze. Compulsion is a social disease. False fresh starts, schemes, fresh false schemes, false starts, stale dreams. It all happened so fast. Anyway, the bird has flown. Tomorrow comes, forgets the past. No need to be on your own, sitting on the edge of a knife, like a frightened rabbit in the kindergarten of life. Hey, Mr. Lighthouse Keeper. I'm a Viking asylum seeker. We are ships in the night. All I can do is project. When you get me in your sight, take, take me, me to your dream weaver. My world stands on its head. Hey, Mr. Lighthouse Keeper, I'm a Viking asylum seeker. Take me to your dream weaver. Let me get a toehold in this in world. This world. Get a toehold in this, in this world. world. Let me get a toehold in this, in this world. world around which a serpent is curled. If you play the game and get lucky, you can have a party, but you're still just another chicken in Kentucky. If I had a conscience, I'd shatter the silence, stop sitting on the fence. 
If you got a buddy, that's your fate. If you're in a skin, jump right in. Don't be late. Take a breather and celebrate. Switch on your love receiver. Goddesses play on the highway. Love hurts. Like a double-edged sword, truth comes first. And if the stars fall out of the sky, oh lord. Oh lord, it's only shooting stars. Venus, Venus wrapped in the arms of Mars. Mars. Well, that was Asylum Seekers by Paul Cop. A poem by Paul Cop. Um, I used, I, I made actually a, a digital sound collage out of it, and you can you can watch it as well on YouTube. You can find the link here in my descriptions, in my podcast descriptions. Um, I must say, I really enjoyed the work, and actually, so there is already an exhibition which I still have on the go since two years, but due to COVID, I couldn't, I couldn't make it. Uh, it's a funeral of the Esther Colleen. Uh, I'm still working on one or two paintings. It's still not finished. So I was getting so distracted, so I call it actually already, so it's everything what, what it, I call it the new BC. It's not before Christmas. Uh, before Christmas, it's actually before COVID. So... If I refer to that, if I say BC, it is everything happened before COVID. All right. So I would say that was Paul. And um, yeah, it was a great, great, great chat. And uh, we're still in contact. And uh, it is nice, you know, so to, to stay, I must say, I stay with, with most of my, my talk guests in conversation in contact and it's lovely so so we support each other somehow and and uh, create a quite good network which is for me actually i see it more and more and more the reason why i'm gonna do this podcast you know so it is it is not a podcast about the economy and uh, it's a podcast about yeah being kind and uh, and uh, creating networks yes so uh, after Paul, I had another artist. Um, this was actually a musician, more or less. So, uh, I was diving with Lou McMahon into the unknown and exciting devotion of the creative mind. Uh, so in this three podcast episodes, we talk about her childhood and early inspiration in Six Mile Bridge, County Clare, because she is from Six Mile Bridge, County Clare, obviously. Uh, we talk about her online experience as a singer-songwriter, and uh, we talk as well about about this strange feeling in a lockdown to sing to an audience without an audience, just alone in, in front of your camera. I mean... Um, it is for 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 us all a, a, a new a new new feeling so so pff, strange but it works somehow at the end we we speak as well about about Lou's aspiration as a media composer and and far more things far more things i mean, I mean each episode we we listen as well to one of Lou McMahon's songs so uh so yeah, so that that was I think it was already the um episode 22 22.1, 22 22.2 22 and 22.3. So because I divided it as this time in 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 three parts in 1 2 3. So if you if you're in, interested in in uh, the way how how Irish singer songwriters work and 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 tick yeah, just Join us there in, in this conversation. This it was it was really 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 nice. Especially I mean, so Lou, Lou is a singer songwriter. He's she's media music composer, session vocalist, animal lover, and and as well, um, a cultural reporter from County Clare. I think she's she's gonna doing something for 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 Limerick FM and for the, for the for another. Uh, RTE FM culture culture FM thing um, 
The songs showcase multitude of melodic riches in a vibrant package described in the in the media as a somehow as a, as a jazz thread crossover. Uh, she has a very haunting voice, and uh, and and this this combined with thought-provoking lyrics and uh, beautiful melodies make her one to watch. It is as well. I mean, so a quote from the Irish Daily Mail. So, yeah, that was that one. Lose, lose. <laughs> that was really the interesting thing. Was she sent me? What I gonna do normally is, um. I ask my my talk guests um, for for an image from an earlier life. So so she sent me one image where she was in a yellow dress. Uh, that was <laughs> really quite quite very inspiring. So I made a lot of artworks with it on Instagram. So. Uh, because I realized that actually Instagram is somehow my, my my sketchbook where where I'm gonna use my inspirations for my talk guests, because they send me always, like I say, images from 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 their hometown, from from themselves, maybe from from a nice experience what they had and so on. And I try to to set up a, an interesting collage in order to to create a, a, as well. Um, max with it and this max they are as well a part of of being in the hall of attitude so which is actually where where every one of my my guests in in conversations coming in so i made a couple of max with her for in, and they are already as well in the hall of attitude uh and you can find all that I mean, you can find all these images on Instagram if you go to my to my Instagram account at datschlich.com or at Attitude. You find other world, uh, other other images as well. Attitude.com or I love West Cork artist. So you find as well um all these informations on facebook if you join the isle of west cork artist group so you're more than welcome to join us there because we still have a a conversation over there and uh, the people are sharing artwork and uh it's from all over the world actually so 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 it's really it's a very nice and interesting way to to keep our discourse, creative discourse going, especially in in times like this. So yes, yeah, so and like I say, so if you want to listen to loose songs, you can you can as well go to this podcast episode twenty two because you can listen to the songs at the end of the podcast. Mm. If you want to support this podcast. Um, you can go to www.artitude.com and uh, there you can find either all the podcasts as well or artwork like Max and uh, Hall, Hall of Artitude Max. Um, other things were more or less currently as, as a sort, quite sort of, of a merchandising. Um I see, I see it actually more more like a dig digital shaman. You see, I mean, I produce actually so online. No, no, I produce offline work. Um, prepare this work. For I, I I upload it online, and people can download it again, and they get it offline, and they have it at home, and so I. So I close the circle, which I find actually a quite interesting concept as a digital artists of the 21st century yes i would say for today that's it it was quite short but uh, due to the fact that st still uh, a lot a lot of things are to do the promotion for for launch next saturday at five o'clock irish time and um 
I would say on that note, I would really, 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 really stress it again. So I think the only thing what happens current helps currently is is that we are be kind to each other and uh, we try to be a change don't start to hate russians don't start to hate actually anyone so let's try somehow with with, with sending love to each other changing the world a little bit being creative changing the world with art world saving art might help hopefully my dear guys, my dear friends, my dear podcast listeners, thank you very much all over the world to listen to me and uh, I'm always happy to get some comments from you and um, I wish you all over the world a peaceful time. I mean, I know I can't wish it everywhere for now, but... but Let's hope that this madness somehow ends. On that note, take care and I hug you all. Bye bye. You have listened to Artie Jude, West Cork's first art, fashion, and design podcast. Artie Jude, never so close again. Ah! That was too close.